Hi, I'm Helen from Twinkle. Today we're going to look at lesson packs. Lesson packs that are specific to maths. Let's take a look. All of our Planet Maths resources have an overview. This is to make sure that teachers, parents and carers are supported when teaching these activities. There is a yearly overview and a suggestion of lesson breakdowns. Each lesson has a synopsis of what is included in the lesson pack, as well as the link to the national curriculum statement. Once you've selected the lesson pack that you want to download, click on download and it may take some time because there are lots of resources in each pack. Once it has downloaded, open it. In it, you will find lots of useful things. One of them is a lesson plan. It gives you lots of detail about how to teach this task. You can pick which bits are appropriate for what you need. Also, there's a PowerPoint presentation, a marking grid and a success criteria. In the resource pack, you will find activity sheets. In the activity sheets, they are clearly differentiated depending upon the ability of the child. They are labelled one star, two stars and three stars. They also include the answers. Lots of our Planet Maths lesson packs have diving into mastery sections. These are carefully designed activities to take the child through a learning journey, initially ensuring that they are fluent with the key concept being taught, then applying this to a range of reasoning and problem solving activities. These are differentiated by diving, deeper and deepest. These activity cards might not necessarily be used in a linear way. Some children may begin at the deeper section and in fact others may dive straight into the deepest section if they have already mastered the skill and are applying this to show their depth of understanding. This measuring capacity lesson pack focuses on measuring and recording capacity using non-standard units. It has a comprehensive lesson plan, an interactive PowerPoint and activities. This spoon challenge activity sheet within the pack is great. Collect a few recycled containers and pick something to spoon into them. Here I've used lentils. It allows children to make predictions before carrying out the activity and then answer a few simple questions based on the data they've collected. The second part to this lesson introduces standard units using litres and millilitres when measuring capacity. Lots of our Planet Maths lesson packs also have specifically home learning activities. They are differentiated going from one star, which is the most simplest activity, to three stars. You could work progressively through the three sheets or pick the one to suit the specific needs of each individual child. The great thing about this is you can measure using your hands and feet or you can use the ruler provided on the sheet. also have lots of packs of starter ideas to accompany the planet lesson packs. This enables you to pick and choose a little activity that you could use at the start of a lesson or just as and when you feel you could do a little mathematical activity. They come on an A4 piece of paper to print off or as a PowerPoint presentation with interactive activities on. We also have lots of packs of challenge cards to help children build up their understanding of a certain topic. We've got loads of lesson packs on our website. Why not go and check them out? They're not just for teachers, even though they're incredible for teachers. You can use them at home. I'll see you soon.